everybody. Owen's going to help me today with our daily dojo. Owen, do you know what day it is today? Friday. Not just Friday. 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 In my class, we call it Fun Friday. So we're going to use your finger lights that you took home in your homeschool bags for your um, daily dojo today. Oh, we also have little Ruffy and Lady Ruffy with us. All right, so Owen's gonna help us out okay, with this. So you're gonna need a blank piece of paper and some scissors. So you're gonna fold your paper up just like you did yesterday. Okay, a grown up can help you with that. And then you're gonna open it up and cut on all those lines. So I've already done that, see? And then, I'm gonna cut them in half again. I just cut them all in one big batch. Okay, so these are little cards and you're gonna make a memory game. And I know you guys have done that with Mrs. Sandry before. Um, your memory game can be literacy or math. I'm gonna show you a couple examples and then I'm gonna show you how to play with your finger lights. Okay, so here are some ideas of what kind of memory game you can make. You can use your sight words like the ones you have on Buddy's Bones or the ones that I assigned you for this week. You can do addition problems. So for example, you might do like three plus four equals on one card and then the answer on another card. Uh, or you could do rhyming words like cat, hat, log, dog, or even make them more challenging like dragon, wagon. So you can have an adult help you with coming up with pairs, but you want to make sure you have, like if you're doing sight words, you would write the sight word twice. You want to make sure you have pairs. You're going to use more cards than this, but I just did this really quickly. So turn your cards over, scramble them up, no cheating. And then here's where the finger lights come in. I'm gonna turn this little light off. All right, so oh, I'll start a new video. So Owen has the finger lights ready for us. I turned off this light over here just to make it a little darker. So each person who's playing gets a light. Give me, oh, you want me to have red? Okay, um, now the way you choose a word is just by shining your light on it. And then your part, whoever's playing with you can flip the word over for you, but you're not gonna go at the same time. Would you like to go first? Yeah. Okay, so he's gonna shine his light. Go ahead, Pick what word are you picking this one? I'll flip it for him and he'll read it. Down. Good, now pick another. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, what word'd you get? Down. You got a match. So he gets to take that and then it's my turn. And so then I would shine my light And he'll flip it for me and I'll read it. Went. And how about this one? Here. Oh, I didn't get a match. So then we'll just flip them back over and then it would be Owen's turn. Now, again, you'd play with more cards than this and you don't have to do sight words. You could do a lot of different things. Math problems, rhyming words, um, get creative with it. But the idea is just have fun, play a game together, and you can use your finger lights. And then you have to have a dance party. Right, Owen? Here we go. Finger light dance party. Finger light dance party. All right, have fun. Fun Friday. Have a good day.